back there. What is that? I can just make out its mouth. And I think it's a tapir. It has a long nose. The tapirs look sort of like a, a funny looking elephant. Let's see if I can get closer. Tapirs are the largest forest animal in Central America. They're not strictly nocturnal, but they prefer to forage for food in the dark when it's cooler. Tapirs are actually really well suited for nighttime activity. So they don't see very well at nighttime, but they hear really well. They've got these big goofy ears that can move around, they can hear really well. Their hearing helps detect predators and their acute sense of smell helps them identify 100 types of plant. Now the reason they eat so many different types of plants is because a lot of the leaves in the rainforest are actually toxic. And so in order to have a balanced diet, they eat a bunch of different things so they don't get too much of one toxin and they can process it. Because of their size, tapirs have few natural predators but humans hunt them for their meat. They're very, very shy, usually. There must be absolutely no poaching in this forest, because he's not afraid of me at all. Oh my god. This thing is walking right towards me. I've never been this close to such a big animal. My heart is beating so fast. I've worked in Central America for over 10 years. I've never seen a tapir. I've always wanted to. It's incredible. Bryson is blind without his camera, but the tapir is completely at home in the dark. When sight fails, other senses compensate. <laughs> 